All the products in this video was bought from Chaos Cards, and you could also buy other trading card games, board games, role playing games, dice, accessories for said board or card games, and miniature games. Ruth here, and this is the Ho O Premium Powers Collection. Though it technically doesn't say Ho O on it, but Ho O is on it, so I figured that's, that's what it's called. Uh, so that's what it the product listing was called when I bought it. Anyway, so as you see, it's jam-packed with loads of stuff. You got like the Shining Lugia here, you got a Pikachu there, Rainbow ho oh, oh, Jumbo Rainbow ho oh, oh. Yeah, the Shining Celebi. Looks very pink. And you got like two, four, six, eight packs, maybe? Alright, this is what it looks like. Along the sides, along the top, it looks like this. And on the back, obviously, and it's huge. So, shining Pokemon of legendary stature. Okay, in the legendary. Now, the legendary Pokemon Ho-Oh is said to bring joy to any trainer who sees it, particularly when it appears as a full art promo card that paints this rainbow Pokemon in rainbow colors. The Shining Legends Premium Powers Collection also includes never-before-seen full cards featuring Shiny Lugia, Shining Celebi, and Pikachu, plus eight TCG Shining Legend booster packs, and a fantastic poster that shows off nine Shining Pokemon. So, and it also comes with a code card as well. And a Jumbo, as I said. And... Well, in this, since it's the UK version, it comes with a poster. However, the uh, American version comes with a playmat instead. Talk about favoritism, like. But anyway. I wish it was a play mat, because that, what I saw, was absolutely awesome. And, um, and as you know, the uh, American version is called, like, a super premium, uh, powers or something. It was huge, came with deck boxes, well, the, uh, the, elite, the elite trainer deck boxes, like, and, uh, and as I said, the play mat. Oh, and a figure. Comes with the Ho-Oh figure. Which, of course, like, the European version doesn't even have a figure. We normally never do figures, we always get jumbo cards instead. So, that's slightly annoying. But what's more annoying is I can't get into the box. I'm trying not to mess up the box too much so I can put up my, the bits that I use. Okay, so... It is huge! I mean, like, come on, the box is huge. Luckily, I've got a new... Um... A scrapbook thing that can fit that size of huge. Okay, so... To get this off, there we go. Huh, we got the thing that sits there, because there, well, you know, there's a poster under there. Oh, uh, I don't think I have any place to put a poster. I mean, like, the only two Pokemon posters I do have, if you just briefly look up here, you got. The Eevee up there, and there's an Eevee on the door. That's it. Unless I put it on the back of the door. Most of the others are, you know, other stuff. Okay. Moving back to what you actually came here to watch. I can move this down a tad. There we go. Just accordingly, and let's hope these things pop out. Pop somewhere. Pop. Okay. Let's see. Yep. 
Yay, two popped out. Yeah. Yeah. Where are they? Things are popping out everywhere now. Okay, so hopefully no damage. Slight ding on the bottom of the Pikachu one, but no matter. This is Bromo 81. Very nice effect there, especially since it's on the beach. Very nice. Uh, that's because it's a promo, and I can put in these can C perfect fits. So that is there. Let's see. Okay, the shiny Lumia. Because it is a shiny. I shall put it in its own shiny uh, sleeve. Since there are three, well, I always put the legendaries in the sleeve anyway. For these, yeah, the very good legendaries. I mean, so the shiny Lugia will go in the shiny sleeve. And what else was this on the floor? I'm not much further on the floor since I am sitting on the floor. The thing is a normal thing and a tiny bit on the corner, but no matter. Shiny celery. I'll uh, go over it in more detail when I finish leaving it up because I get distracted. Very nice, and it is textured, and the full art is. Oh, that's not the full art. The, uh, the jumbo is textured too, which is nice. Though they don't really make jumbo sl card sleeves, I don't think. Okay, so let's just go over these awesomeness. So we've got a Sacred Fire Phoenix Burn and the Eternal Flame GX. Promo SM80. It is very cool. And because I don't want it to be uh, thinged up. If I can open this thing I have on the side here. I did actually buy these Jumbo uh, top loaders. Well, they're called photograph top loaders. They are 6 inches by 9 inches, by the way. And they look like this. They are from the BCW company not Ultra Pro, because the Ultra Pros are more expensive than these ones. So, they come in sets of 25, and I bought two. So, last time I only bought 10, because I didn't really think of how many jumbos I'd actually end up getting. So, I did not think ahead of that one. So, here we go. Not only for the other Jumbos, which I do have a picture up up on my snups. You can check it out if you want. But uh, I know I put one in the back as well, so I can save space and time for me to uh, uh, not have to buy extra ones that I don't need. <clears throat> okay, so let's just put these out for now. Leave always gets cut. And in the end, very nice that we have at least one of each of them. Wait, do we? One, two, three, four. Yeah. At least one of each of them. And to show that the code card does exist. There it is. You know, this is actually pretty nice. I could probably use this on my desk for like pencils and stuff. I might actually do that. <laughs> Don't know why I would do that, but uh, just very handy for like like a desk or a tray organizer thing. So I'll keep that. <laughs> yes. 
my brother did say I hoard really random stuff. Okay, so I just move this over up. I'm like doing this on a box thing, so uh, I am uh, doing this on four. Okay, so for the poster, which I'm happy it comes with something like this, but it is not a playmat. I'm going to play that with, you know, proper, uh, fabric-y play mat, not a thing. So this is, the poster. It is awesome looking, don't you think? And it's not as big as I thought it might have been, so I might be able to stick it on my door. Maybe, maybe not. It is a bit wide. Put it on the wide side. I don't know. Do I want to stick it anywhere? I wonder if I can laminate it. I'll have to do that at the library if I can laminate it. But uh, let me just put the poster in the box for now over there. Save. Me not losing anything. Okay, so as I said, I'd go over it better. Now I just look at that spread there. So awesome. Anyway, as I said, I would go over this a bit better. So you got the whole rainbow full art. But I did kind of go over it with the jumbo one. So uh, yeah, there we go. You have the shining Celebi. And that's got a time recall ability and leaf step. I'll put up the pictures of these in better detail at the end of the video anyway. Shiny Lugia. And these ones still, they uh, texture the actual Pokemon and holographic that part and leave the background. So that's great. We got Argent Wing and Arrow, for Arrow Force. And obviously the Pikachu. Then to wave an electro ball. I quite like that move anyway. Oh yes, and uh, this is a SM82 and SM79. Okay, so let's get started. And uh, since we have three of Mew. Two of Genesis and two of Mew. So we got there, there, there. Mm -hmm. And we quase her. Okay, we shall do it in that section. In that order. Okay. So. I really need it in the frame, but uh, there we go. I need to redo my battery again. And these videos take up a lot of battery when I'm doing this, though. I have been recording non-stop, so... Okay, so hopefully I can get at least... No, 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 I don't have to play it safe and change the battery now. So I'll be All back right. now. We're back now. So we have the Shining Way Quasar. Hopefully we get a Shiny, because I haven't put the Shiny yet. And as I have said... I will give at least one card away in each Pokemon opening. And fighting energy. Okay, and uh, <clears throat> since there is eight packs, I might give away two. It depends if I pull a, uh, a an ultra rare or a shiny or secret or whatever. Anyway, so spirit two, double colors energy, Sophocles, Zora, Ekans, Pikachu, Karakuna, Prudent. Awesome! I love the the reverse. Uh, Hollow energies. It's 
because they're so shiny and this like it looks like it's underwater this uh, hollow so so fitting for the water anyway so where is a Rayquaza I don't know what what am I saying a uh, Raikou the that's an R yeah I'm just going to go ahead and sleeve the water because I like it so much. Because <laughs> I, I, uh, depending on what type they are and whatever, I sleeve them in different sleeves because the KMC Perfect Fit are much more expensive than the normal Ultra Pro card sleeves. Two, four. You got psychic energy. How? Wolf energy. Carnivine. Voltor. Scraggy. Bull weasel. Miner. Stunfisk. Huh, we got a double mining in this one. So we've got a reverse mining. I don't know if I actually pulled that yet. And over there is a Jamin. Yes, I can't read today, it seems. You know what? Here you go. Ooh, we got a fire. Great ball. It's grafty. Damage mover. Which I think is pretty good, from what I read on it. Move three damage counters from one of your Pokemon to another. So, from the main one to a benched one, that's, that's always handy. Larvesta. Pirate Lane. Shroomish. Quillfish. Ivysaur. Reverse Carnivine. And a rare is... Hoopa. So, red jet effect. Not really a favorite because I don't really like robots, but I like the color. The original color is purple, and I don't like purple. <laughs> uh, you know what? Here you go. Of course, it would be funny if this turns out to actually be me giving the code away anyway. But anyway, so that was, was that two codes for this one? Anyway, we got a water energy. A okay, Floatzel, so we got the Evolution Chain there, Arbok, Pokemon Breeder, Torkoal, Totodile, especially have the Pokemon Chain now, <laughs> Breezel that was, we got a Plusle, Torkat, a Lipard Reverse, and a rare is a Palkia. Um, I don't have very big space here, so I'll just show the names about that. Please be something good, because this box was pretty expensive. And we've got three packs left after this one. So we got a fairy energy. I might have saw something shiny. Awesome. DC, Sophocles, Super Scoop Up, Minin, Torkoal, Cliffish, Draggy, Torcat, Reverse Lily, and where is it? Awesome! Of course it has to be the one that I didn't actually like, but still awesome! Shining Genesect. I wish it was a Mew or a Quasar, but still, it is very red, which is nice. I like red. I think I said that before. Anyway, still, awesome. Ability, energy, reload, and Gaia Blaster, is it? And this has got like a, uh, 
can you see the, like the little shiny speck there? That is a silver star. Yeah, I guess silver star. There's a number nine of seventy-three. Finally got a shiny. So let's put it in a proper shiny sleeve to enhance its shininess. Probably doesn't, but still. So awesome. So, so far there's like three shinies in this. And, uh, three. What? Hang on. This is three. Four, five, six, seven, eight. So I already gave away two, so count the other one as that one. So, uh, I do sell these either on my Facebook, well mainly on Facebook because the minimum price you can get for codes is on eBay is like 99p, which is kind of a ripoff I think, because like, I sell these, I don't know about the Shining Legend ones, but some of the other codes I do for like 20 to 30p each, depends. But maybe that's like the flat line rate I do because I can sell more that way. And I need the money if I'm going to buy more of this stuff. Also, if you do want to donate and be very awesome doing it, um, I do have my PayPal link in the description below. If you want to send me any fan mail or anything, I do have my email, which then I'll send you the address and whatnot. So, we have metal energy a scrafty I'm trying to not knock over my piles over here right damage mover how brave la vesta pirate lane crocodile go it a reverse pirate lane and it's got a uh, a messed up because that is actually there. Because obviously in the normal pirate lane, we don't have a uh, circle dot. And that circle dot is like the misprinted part of Litten. And that's like the holographic part that's shone through. Because that is a shiny dot. So that's cool. We got a misprint, sort of. That was nice. And a rare is a Zekron. I'm still looking for Rush Ram, I think. But I only have one of those, so that's fine. Please be something good. Like, I don't know. Just something good. Be like a Mewtwo. Oh, I see something. I don't know. Cause, uh, the only full art of the uh, normal set, not the rainbow, is the uh, Mewtwo full art that I'm missing. Though I'm also missing the normal Mewtwo GX and a normal uh, Entei GX, but I didn't ha get the full art. So if you want to see that, just uh, look at one of my uh, Elite Trainer boxes. I can't remember which one. I think it was the second Elite Trainer box. Anyway, Leaf or Grass Energy. I don't just call it Enlisted Leaf like I do sometimes because, like, after listening to it for so long, you kind of forget. So, like, most of these are all doubles anyway, so, like, they're going like a bulk thing for me to sell or something. Though I'll ask my brother if he wants some first, I guess, to be nice. And my, one of my piles won't stay still. Okay, we got a Torcat Reverse and a Rare Is. Hoopa. I thought I saw something. Okay, last pack magic. Let's hope Mew's got it in for us. Though I'm not sure that's a good thing. But anyway. Because I mean, normally when you say you got something in for somebody, that's, that's not a good thing. But uh, hopefully it's a good thing in this case.
please be something good. Though, a shiny Genesect is good for this box, which was really expensive. Uh, we got a Fairy Energy, Electrode, Float Soul, Scrafty, I'm getting ahead of myself, Pikachu, a Freaky Jinx. I mean, like, their artwork has not gotten any less creepy. Uh, Croconaw, Scraggy, Weasel, a Reverse Verizion, which I do not have yet, so that is good. And where is another Hoopa? I mean, I got three Hoopas in this one thing. I mean, is Hoopa stalking me or something? Because, like, that is just... Uh... So, uh, yeah. So, obviously, I will be selling at least one or some. So I might actually have three Hoopas already. I'll have to reconsult my folder. But uh, yes, so that is everything. All of this good stuff, especially the uh, fantastic shiny Genesect. So uh, that's all what you get in this. Too bad the poster wasn't a play mat, because that would look awesome too. But then again, I can probably laminate this, so it's still could work as a playmat too, I guess, if I laminate it. Anyway, so, thank you for watching. Like and subscribe for more. Over and out.